Hello there, and welcome to Eureka's Video Classroom. In today's video session, we will be covering how to download and install your digital certificate. So let's get to it, you guys. So the first thing we want to do is locate our welcome email. That's where we're going to find our digital certificate in order to download and install to our computer. Let's open up our email inbox. And then our welcome email is going to have a subject title of WebPaws, our company name, in this case it's Eureka Revenue, and our TID. Uh, the next thing we want to do is just make sure that we verify our information. So we're going to verify our store name and our store address. If for any reason your store name or store address is incorrect, please contact our customer service department and they will be able to reissue your welcome email. Please do not proceed on with your download until you receive your new email. If everything is good to go, then we can proceed on to downloading our digital certificate. So we want to, what we want to do is just hover over this link and we're going to click on it and it's going to redirect us into a login page. It's going to ask for a username and password, which can be located back in our welcome email. So we're going to click back to our welcome email. And after this link, where you're going to see a username and a password. So what we want to do, we're just going to copy and paste. And then we're going to enter our password. And then we're going to click on submit. And then our digital certificate pop-up window will appear. This is just letting us know that we're about to download our digital certificate. So we're going to click on download now. And then we're going to access our downloads folder. So we're going to go to downloads. And then you'll see web pause certificate. And then all we want to do is just open that up. And then your certificate import wizard will appear. So what we want to do is just click on next. And then the next page is going to let us know where we want to save this digital certificate. We'll just leave it at default and click on next. And then it's going to ask us for a password. We're going to be able to locate this back in our welcome email. So we're going to go back to our welcome email. And then if we scroll down, we're going to see a screenshot of the same page. But down below, it says enter your private key password. We're just going to copy and paste. We're going to make sure all three of these are enabled. And then we're going to click on next. And then the next page, we're just going to click on next here. So the next page is just confirming our download. So we're just going to click on finish and then importing a new private exchange key. On this pop up, we're just going to click on OK. And then you're going to receive a pop-up stating the import was successful. And you're going to click OK. And that's it, you guys. And remember, you can always go back to your welcome email, and it has the same information with a step-by-step -step guide with screenshots. So that's pretty much it. Please remember that you can always leave us your questions or concerns down below on this video. Leave us a comment. Let us know how we're doing or what you would like to see more. And that's pretty much it, you guys. Have a great day, and that's it.